Welcome back, everybody. Um, hey, Kane. Yeah. We are. Was that shade on the beach the other day? How did you know it was trying to protect the postman? Just a feeling, I guess. <laughs> All right. We are going back to Poplar and see what she has to say about the shipwreck. Um, after that, we'll probably do either a side quest, because I have to get some stuff done from the Divine Tree, or, which was in the Lost Shrine, or we're gonna do main quest. Um, just for everybody else, so we did some editing of the words. Um, gonna go magic power plus 10 and XP rate plus 15. And with weapons, we actually... Uh, hold on, I gotta sneeze. No. Okay, so we're gonna use Faith as our main weapon if we have non-guarded enemies. Um, which means attack power plus 15, XP rate plus 15. And for enemies with guard break, we have to use the, the Beast Lord. So we're gonna swap weapons between the fights having either a two-handed sword or we're gonna go with fate um lances i'm not too much into lances at the moment but let's see how that develops uh, in the future still not hold on i wanted to check what the the level goes uh, probably the level is just increasing um The level is probably just increasing my health bar. Let's see. Mm. Mm. No, can't seem to find anything that's weird. Well, let's continue. We'll learn it as we go. Mm -hmm. 
shades on the coast, the ferryman dead, you've had quite the rough trip. That poor ferryman used to tell me stories of the epic quarrels he had with his wife. He found the whole thing quite amusing. He loved her, though. He loved her with all that he was. I'm very sad to hear that he's gone. Still, you made it back safe, and I'm glad for that. <clears throat> Have you any new information about the key to the Shadow Lord's castle? I'm still working on the decryption, but I'm afraid progress has stalled. Loyal Cerberus might refer to a dog, but I've never seen anything that would fit the bill. It must be pretty complicated if even you can't decode it. Well, you're our last hope, so... I will. By the way, I was walking by your house earlier and I noticed you had some mail. Thanks. Oh, one last... Since the ferryman was missing work, I arranged for someone else to handle... I'll make sure they know to let you use... Gotcha. Okay, so the fairies are back in business. Even without those we have lost, the world relentlessly continues to turn. I have mail. Official note. This is the official notice that the king of his head has chosen to enter the ceremony of matrimony. Matrimony was that. Please lodge all objections on sincerely the facade royal office of marriage and other legal bindings. P.S. Hey guys, it's me, king of facade. Sorry, this is not formal and stuff. Listen, I'm getting married. We want you to come, so get over here. Okay. King is getting married. Uh, does this old book good to see a boy? Probably not a good idea to turn down a wedding in, but let's go to facade. Um. Okay. So, uh, can we go to facade? Do we have to? Do we have to go now? Huh? Well, let's go to facade now. Okay. Oop, there's a quest on top. I'm gonna pick that up as we go there. That's one of the kids. The forest totally cursed him. That's why he's sick. It appears something happened to the child when he entered the northern woods. I believe that area is... You think there's actually a forest? I will withhold judgment on such things. All right. To... Yeah. So we cleared that. Oh, there. Let's go to celebrate a marriage. Oh, the wolves are on it again. Does it not strike you as curious to find wolves in the desert? Should it? They normally live in forests, yes. Deserts would seem to hold little sustenance for them. Well, we can certainly guess what they've been eating. Wolf fang, wolf fang, wolf fang, all the wolf fangs in the world. Here, more of it. The rest of them. No, they're not really a challenge anymore. Or <laughs> well, 
the king's invitation. Just do a quick save. Oops. We go. There he is. Ah, Kakere. We hear your days of bachelorhood are come. Congrats. Forgive my prying, but we are all eager to know the identity of your lucky. Kitsurekita. Saikyo. Fira? You have grown into a fine example of womanhood. I'm sure you will make Kaine's gonna want to see this. Ha ha ha. Say, you're going to be a good guy. You're going to be a good guy. Oh, you're going to be a good guy. Pleased to make your acquaintance, your royalness. Congratulations on your... Hug. Um, I'm sorry, Kaine's not here. You're going to be a good guy. 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 Of course. To think they even have rules governing the timing and water temperature of a bath. What's it to you? You don't even take baths. Kane? What is the matter? I don't like this. Weddings are festive occasions, you know? Should I even be here? We were invited here by the king, remember? Sure. But what about everybody else? This city isn't like our villages. It's all about... And since there isn't a specific rule about you, I honestly think they won't give a crap. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> Will you at least procure a new set of lingerie for the festivities? <laughs> Some spring colors? Keep talking, book. Oh. What's up? Uh, just having trouble getting to sleep. Something bothering you? No. The op I'm just so excited about the wedding that I can't settle. I bet it's gonna have streamers and dancing and fairs on unicycles and ev I'm sort of jealous. <laughs> I wish I was beer. Yeah, every wedding has beers on unicycles. That's You'll for find sure. A nice bride someday, Emil. Huh? <laughs> you must be tired indeed if you misunderstood that simple social nice. <laughs> Bed chambers are empty. Exactly it. Liu Teta Weta Telegram to Kuzesh to Zuite Kaisamo took it. Don't she? Everyone needs to blow off steam and celebrate once in a while. Indeed, your people have earned a moment of rest and Kodeta. Plus, you want to make Fira happy. Anyway, life is better when you have someone to fight for. Ah, weddings are the best. There's flowers everywhere. Everyone's happy. It's just great. I'm kind of jealous. Aren't you jealous, Kaine? Oh, come on. Igyuto Lasenchi Koi Arteruwa Shisu Yorinchi Kotechi Saito Zuse Oteiki. Satereruta.
Yeah, that was sure to happen. Okay. What the fuck? Wolf shade. That wolf is a shade. The leader seems to have the power to reflect magic. Hmm. The mm -hmm. wolves appear to be targeting you. Yeah, it kind of reflect magic, but he's still gonna get ripped on it. Whacked anyway, and he summons even more. Oh man, how can you ruin such a wedding? Wait, is she dead? I would rethink this course of action, King. Ahead lies a battle you cannot win. Well, that's how the wedding goes. I doubt he will stand down at this point. I'm assuming we're gonna go kill the wolves now. Yes, and he'll run off to take on the wolves any time. Will we let him go, Wayans? Of course not. Hell, I hate. Then we must prepare for. The it will not be an. I know what. The only thing that gets me really is like every time something positive happens, like everybody is having a good time, 
one of those people will die. Which is really frustrating. But, well, it is what it is. That's the storytelling of Yokotaro. And, um... I'm going to continue with ramping up the wolves uh, in the next episode. So I'm going to catch you later after the well-received horrible ending wedding. <laughs>